Hello, welcome to the Lauren Harity Cooking Show, and I'm your host, Lauren Harity. Today, we'll be making peanut butter fudge squares, which was made a long time ago, way back in colonial times. Now, here are the ingredients. Half cup of light corn syrup, three quarters cup of peanut butter, half cup of softened butter, Three quarters cup of chopped pecans, half teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of vanilla, and about four cups of sifted powdered sugar. You could use less powdered sugar, like about two cups or two and a half, or you could use regular sugar. Now we are going to start making it. Here are the directions. Combine the butter, syrup, just put that in there. Now I'm going to pour in the three quarters cup of peanut butter. Now I'm using chunky peanut butter, which means filled with peanuts, but you could use regular. Every last bit. Can't waste any food. Now we need to get half a teaspoon of salt to pour into our lovely mixture. Now we have to get one teaspoon of vanilla. Now I'm going to mix the mixture so it's harder and then because it's supposed to be like a candy so it's going to be hard. And, um, yes. Okay, after a little while of stirring, you have to add about two and a half cups of sugar, powdered sugar. So... There's no big chunks in there. Now this should make a this should make a very stiff mixture too. Almost like a batter. Well maybe not like a batter, but like the cake after the batter. Yeah. Make sure you get everything. Now we're going to pour it out onto our board. Easy as cake. And put our pecans on there. Okay, so now we're gonna knead it like bread. I'm 
add some pecans. Now you should keep kneading the mixture until all the pecans are gone. After the things they're all mixed in, all the pecans mixed in very good, you're going to put it in a buttered pan, or like this, where you have some wax paper. Now we're just going to make sure that it's level, and poke it in the corners, and on the sides, and in the middle, so that it just doesn't look weird. And now, since this program is for any kids, this does not need to be cooked, but it does need to be chilled overnight. Okay, after it's chilled, you're going to cut it into about um, two inch squares or any size. Thank you for watching. Now I would like to say some thank yous. Thank you to our website designer. Yes, um, um, and I would like to thank Door Pink for sponsoring this program. Thank you for watching. And check out our website, www.colonialrecipesforkids.org. Thank you for watching. a cold and I'm really poor so I can't get any medicine. Well you should go on down to Door Pink. Door Pink? What is that? Door Pink is a place where you can get medicine for reasonable prices. I need to go there. Okay, see you later. Bye. <coughs> I'm sick. Well, how are you sick? I have a cold. Oh no, here, let me get you some medicine. Wow, that was fast. Yeah, I already feel a little better, and I got some medicine too. Sweet. Well, that is guaranteed at Door Pink. Wait, um, who are you? <laughs> that was weird. <gasps>
Okay, I lost my medicine. Were you here earlier? I was here earlier. I was helped by a, a lady named like Mrs. Smith or something. She gave me some aid bail. Okay, well, I'll go fetch Mrs. Smith. Hello? Oh yes, I remember you. You were here earlier. I gave you some ad film. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello everyone. If you are ill, just come on down to Door Pink. We help anyone from any age. Hello everybody. Door Pink makes me feel better when I had a fever. See everyone. I love you. I love you, little child. <laughs>